so bad. This one of my favorite books because just when you read all of it, this. I, I ain't lying, bro. I probably ain't read Esther in a long, long time. Read that. It says, the book of the records and the articles today were read for the king. It was found written that Mordecai had told of but Natalia and Chesra, two of the king's uh, chamberlains, the keepers of the door who sought to lay hand on the king, Azariah's. It's like, I don't know how to read And the king said, what honor and dignity had been done to Mordecai for his They said the king's servant that ministered unto him, there is nothing done for him. That's, good. That's sweet though. That's in the Bible though. It's like, That's I'm going to get me one of them readers though. You know, that'd be nice though. You'd be laying the night, just relaxing, a little drink. Like, come on, man. you read me them Chronicles. Come on, I got to hear them. Yeah, read, read. I, I want to hear them Proverbs. You know what I mean? Got the bath and she was like, "Your royal penis is clean, your highness." With your power, man, people gonna be willing to do everything. They gonna be wanting to do it. They gonna, they don't want to die, man. <laughs> Shit. That's gonna be some demon-like power, man. I, that really is, cause we like the, hey, the Most High. They call him the Allah Shaja, the demon-like right. power, right. and he gonna give us power. Right. We gonna be working at, We gonna put that fear in this nation. Yeah, we are gonna be like demons to the nation. Yeah. They be like these motherfuckers. Hey, they, we like demons to them now. Think about it. We like a fucking apparition to the ass. You know, we got, oh, this is your boy right here. He got apparition. Yep. Look, everybody looking all miserable. Look at Slick. Look at Slick. Oh, yeah. Look at my nephews. Oh, fucking Slick. Really? Don't be the man. He's the one that hate me. Different level. Even want to do that? Yeah. You gotta be yeah. fucked in the head. Yeah, they just want to repress their own people. Go ahead. This going back to Edmund last night. Yeah, let's go back to the basically the three of us. Now, excuse me, I ain't gonna read all of it. Three months these nations came from it. Ooh! I got the perfect preset for that. Go ahead. It's Joshua. 9 and 22. And Joshua, or Yahweh Shah in his name, he called for them and he spat unto them, saying, Wherefore have you beguiled us, saying, it's, it's him talking to the heathens, saying, We are very far from you when you dwell among us. Now therefore you are cursed, and there shall none of you be free from being bound man, for he was the woods and jars of water for the house of my God. And they answered Joshua and said, Because it was certainly told thy servants have that Yahweh that God committed to servant Moses. Give all the land <clears throat> to destroy all the inhabitants of the land from before you. Therefore, we were sore afraid of all our lives because of you and have and have done <laughs> these things. Pretty much before they they uh they uh they pretty much they, they uh they made themselves look poor and you know made themselves look like they was like from a far journey. They said, uh, you know, please make a promise to us that you won't kill us. We, you know, we just serve you or something like that. So they pretty much did that because they were afraid. Uh, it says. <clears throat> And we're so afraid of our lives because you, because of, of you, and have and have done this thing. And this is after the Jericho cross fell too. It says, and now behold, we are in thine hand, as it seemed good and right unto thee to do unto us. To do it's like, and so did he unto them and delivered them out of the hand of the children of Israel, and they slew them not. And Joshua made them that day he was a wood and drawings of water. <laughs> the, the congregation for the altar of Yahweh, even to this day, in the place which he. Should choose. There you go. Because they're going to see our power, man. They're going to see all them, the weird ways we're going to be killing them, man. We're going to have motherfuckers, we're going to peel motherfuckers through spiritual power <laughs> like a banana, man. He, he said the weird ways we're going to be killing them. <laughs> right. That really is. I mean, is, seriously, though. can you imagine if somebody, you saw somebody get peeled? Yeah, get peeled like a banana. You gonna, your mind going to be like, that's what, they did, serve you. that's what they did to us, though. There you go. The back of beans, yeah. yeah, the back of beans. Yeah. They did uh, the emperors right. of Rome did that to the uh, to the so-called Christians too. 
They was killing us, cooking us alive. Oh, the Christians getting terrorized yeah. right now. Over there in the Middle East, yeah, in Africa. Yeah, oh, get terrorized. They get terrorized, man. Yeah, get terrorized. They're really, you, you're supposed to be praying for Israelites all around yeah, the earth. Yeah, yeah. Just getting persecuted like that. So that's going to get delivered all yeah. over the four corners. Did you got you got brothers over there, like, there are some real brothers, man, that's over there in the Middle East getting terrorized by them motherfucking, uh, them goddamn Muslims. Getting terrorized by them. <laughs> Muslims, that's a hell, that's a hell of a terror. And then plus you got some of our, uh, Allah, Allah, some of our people are actually Muslims too. Because you got a lot of Muslims might actually be Jakes. You hit Baltimore with my motherfucking tribe. Oh, Baltimore? <laughs> hey, I got a preset for you. I got one too. Uh, well, this is the good one, but it's going into the heathen nations. By what are we going to do to the heathens? Psalms 2 and 1. Why do the heathen rage and the people imagine a vain thing? The kings of the earth set themselves and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord, against his anointed, saying, Let us break their bands asunder and cast away the cords from us. Right? Because that's what they were saying. You know, they was mad David had him down and all that. He that sitteth in the heavens shall laugh. The Lord shall have them in derision. Talk about the heathen nations. Then shall he speak unto them in his wrath and vex them in his sore displeasure. Yet have I set my king upon my holy hill of Zion. <coughs> I will declare the decree. The Lord has said unto me, Thou art my son, this day have I begotten thee. Ask me, ask of me, oh here it is right here. Ask of me and I shall give thee the heathen for thine inheritance and the utmost parts of the earth for thy possession that shall break them with a rod of iron, that shall dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Right, that's that weird way you said we gonna destroy them. I mean, that was the point I wanted to bring out. It said that we gonna, uh, we, the heathen nations, that's our inheritance. That's right, that's right. That's like, you know how you get a present? You know how you the little girls grow up, they ask your mom for a pony? Man, you ask your, you know, for a puppy? We want some some Edomite women, some Elamite women. We we want hope. We want slaves. We you want workers. Hell yeah, I take I take them all. They be fit. They don't they be Hell fit, yeah. man. Flat stomachs and everything, man. Damn straight. Edomite. Women. And they, they, they only got one purpose. There's only one thing an Israelite man can do with an Edomite woman. Mm -hmm. And that's that's just, that's just abuse them. That's right. I can't wait to tell the motherfucking fathers, man. You know, to your face, you know, your, your daughter, that fine ass daughter, you can bring her here. You know, Esau don't, bring her here. You know, Esau don't care about his daughter. You know, right, you know, right, you're right, you're right. He's more worried about himself. Fuck, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hey, he, probably, he probably wants to fuck his daughter. He probably already had batter. Shit, that's even disgusting. Ooh, Esau, vaporize. yeah, that's in the kingdom. You they, get that thought in mind, we're gonna vaporize him. Yeah, we're gonna vaporize him. You know how bugs be lying around, flying around, yeah. shit in the ground, calling the ground, they're gonna attack him, man, on the spot. Yeah, that's gets, the most high's eyes. Everything lice, is in existence. Yep, man. lice. Yep, everything in existence. They everything is the most high. Like yep. the caterpillar, when it gets in, you fucks up your crops. Yep. That was the most high to put the spirit on them caterpillars. Right. All them grasshoppers. Locusts. And locusts. There, there was a, uh, what was it? Uh, I think it was, uh, it was in 38, 1938, out west. There was a, a, a wall of locusts. They said it was like, they said it was like a, a two, three miles man. high. And they said it went on for like three days. They said it was going on for three days. And they said, it's called, I can't remember what it was called, something, uh, the great crop. Cicadas, something, man, yeah. referring to the crops being destroyed out west. Yeah. They went berserk, man. I it's like the most high sent them through and just. I had a Lord tell you about them logos in the scriptures. Yeah. They said it, it was, you could see them coming. They said it was and like they three eat miles high. Yeah, coming, man. Like, if you just get a few of a few grasshoppers up in your garden, they, they, they'd do damage with just a few of them. If you got a whole swarm of locusts on your head, they, they eat it. They li it's like a cartoon, bro. They eat the shit so quick. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? They, they, I've seen, I, they would just eat a whole garden like it ain't nothing. Like it ain't nothing. They, they, that that could come too, though. They could, them locusts could. Hey, they've been, they have been giant swarms of locusts uh, across the world lately the past few years. There was a big one on the uh, East Coast here, like, what, two years ago? The cicadas came out, been down there for like 70 years or something. Woo! That'd be terrifying. You see some, some locusts coming to your ass? 
Same, same place. Ancient Egypt got hit. We're we gonna get hit again. Oh, yeah. He got holes. He got pockets with holes in it. That's yeah, the uh, scripture. Uh. <laughs> this is on Isaiah 60 and 8. Who are these that fly as a cloud and as the doves to their windows? Uh oh. So the isles shall wait for me and the ships of stars and stars uh. to bring thy sons from far. Woo. Their silver and their gold with them. Unto the name of the Lord thy power, and how much shall shine, and to the Holy One of Israel, because he hath glorified thee. And the sons of strangers shall build up thy walls. Oh, the sons of strangers shall build up their walls. That's talking about those heathens. The Edomites, Canaanites, all them heathens. Ishmael Expe Expe uh, especially you know, Ishmael. But Esau are gonna get it worse than everybody. Canaan gonna get it pretty bad, but Esau are gonna get it the worst. The sons of the strangers shall build up thy walls, and their kings shall minister unto thee. For in my wrath I smote thee, but in my favor have I have mercy on thee. Therefore thy gates shall be opened continually. They shall not be shut day nor night. Can you imagine all that gold and precious stones, man, that they got hidden, laid up in vaults and shit. Oh, and man, I tell you, too, that the gates shall be open, meaning that the kingdom ain't going to be no war. No, no. Ain't gonna be no need to have to you know, yeah. Hey, he gonna be, yeah, he gonna be on. It ain't gonna be no fucking no battling no more in the kingdom. That shit's gonna be great. And this shit happens sometimes. Isaiah 61 and uh. Oh, no, man, it's so cold. Fuck. The strangers shall stand and feed your flocks, and the sons of aliens shall be your plowmen and your vine Sons of aliens? Oh, shit. Don't let Dad David Ike see that shit. Oh, fuck. You know, they, you know, they take, you know how they do it. They see that actual word alien. They like, see, aliens the room with you. Oh, shit. They're no, but. Miles, they want to take the whole country. Yeah, but in the kingdom of heaven, we ain't doing no work. Shit. I'm trying, trying to do no work in this kingdom. Shit. I'm doing is bending it over doggy style. It, it's got yep. it over, baby. Let me smash it. That could be a lot of work, though, right it's there. It's going to be some work. But we're going to have better respiratory systems. <laughs> we'll, we'll be having all the energy. <laughs> we ain't going to be having no cardio problems, you know what I mean? you be able to tear that ass up, yeah, boy. Yeah, So she ain't going to be able to take as much anyway. And she'll that's be having proof be systems, too, though. That's why you're going to need other women. Right? Oh, yeah. Because she ain't going to need no more dick for at least three months, man. It'll probably, the Lord will probably give us the, everybody, we'll probably, I ain't going to go there, this is too much. Yeah, we can, yeah, I was about to give too many details about, we rule our kingdoms. This is going to say the most high is going to enhance us, that's all I know. For real. We're going to talk about getting enhanced. We ain't going to need none of that fire. <laughs> no, we don't need none of that. Now, we don't, yeah, I don't need that shit now. I don't know, you young ass niggas, 16, 17, 18 years old, be taking that shit, man. Why? I ain't never took Why? it. Why? Stupid. Only Viagra I need is that fat booty. Motherfuckers be ending up in the ER taking that shit. Ooh, fuck all that. That's what happened to Rick. They said Rick Rude, the wrestler. He shot Viagra up in his dick. Oh. It got infected. He had to get his dick chopped off, so he fucking killed him stand himself. Couldn't live with it. Couldn't live with him. Oh, yeah, I'll take it. She too little. Little too. She's too small. No problem. i take it, though. All those women we gonna have is mind, it's mind boggling in itself. And they're gonna be clean too. Wholesome. It'd be the first time you yeah, having a perfectly clean woman in your life. Wholesome. It's like just think too, they're gonna be properly prepared. Hey, tight shit. Hey, just like going back to the book of Esther. The Esther come out twice. You know how when the the, uh, the king of Persia before he would have sex with a woman, he would have her prepared for like a year. He, he would uh, have every day, they would bathe in the oils and the, the different perfume. They had to get for, for like at least a year or something. something I forget the time. You bathe, you bathe that long. And actually, literally gets in the oils. Yeah, so they just dump the natural things to the smell. And their body gets acclimatized to that good smell. You bathe in oils and perfumes every day? You know they had a good shit, he was a king. Hey, you know, he was, he was tearing that ass up. Right. Especially when the earth starts to produce this and its full potential. Yeah. When we back in Cuba, man, man, this is all those things. She's gonna be running like water. Running like water. 
these days, man, these bitches go to the drug store. They go they they get, get that some, bullshit. Yeah, some shit from the drug store. Some jerseys. <laughs> you know? That's that bullshit. Some shit from Crazy. That's oh, what, wait a minute, they're gonna get a prescription for Esau. I can't stand the smell of lotion myself. Like yeah, some of that shit stinks. Man. I just this is just so some nasty that shit smell. Stinks, man. Like chemicals and shit. Yeah, some of that shit stinks. Man. You gotta you gotta get oil with um with um damn I can't remember the name of oil. I try to do it all natural. I, I still got this idea. I try to use all the oils like you said. That, well, first olive oil. I and, can't remember the name. Of it. I'm tripping. What's the the uh, the coconut oil? That's good for the skin and the hair. The coconut. Ugh, shit. You got it. Oh, yeah, it's you can't um, this is first. Um, I know it's damn freezing cold out here. Uh, therefore, like they shall be open to me, they shall not be shut day nor night, that men may bring unto thee the forces of the Gentiles, and that the kings may be brought. The forces of the Gentiles. So we're going to have, hey, just like King Solomon. Because you know some of these heathens have talents and skills too. Like, you know, Hiram Abiff, he was a Canaanite. Builder. But he was a good builder though. I mean, because people think can heathens ain't totally just totally stupid. They learn. Yeah, they, they can, each heathen got their own blessing and shit. Like the Canaanites were good sailors. They was good in them ships. So in the kingdom, we go, you know, we gonna have to, what's that say? The force of the Gentiles or what? Um, that men may bring unto thee the forces of the Gentiles. Yeah, the forces of the Gentiles. And that their kings may be born. For the nation and kingdom that will serve thee shall perish. Yea, those nations shall be utterly wasted. The glory of Lebanon shall come unto thee. The fir tree, the pine tree, and the box together to beautify the kingdom. Did it say the kingdoms that we serve will be utterly wasted? Isn't that what it said? Wasted, right. How you doing? For the nation of king and kingdoms that but, will not serve thee. But what does that tell you, though? What, what nation are we serving right now? Right, right. So that tell you right there that this America is going to be totally wasted. Yeah, yeah. That's proof. That's, you know, people, oh, there's, there's no proof in the Bible. That's proof right there. We served this country. So, so the Lord, whoever, nation of people, Put uh, Israel in the forced slavery. They go. They gonna be utterly wasted. You know what I mean? Yeah, those nations shall be utterly wasted. The Lord of heaven shall come unto thee, the fir tree, the pine tree, and the box together to beautify the place of my sanctuary. Oh yeah, so my, you know, we have we be building in the kingdom. Just like in the, you know, in the Old Testament, High Rebbe, he got them big, them good cedars from uh, Lebanon. We gonna do that again. We're going we to go all across the earth getting the best shit, you know? Again, everything's going to grow in its full potential. So in the kingdom, you might, you might be... The trees going to be bigger than these fucking buildings, In man. the kingdom, they're going to be new trees and new species and shit you ain't never seen. Because just think about how many uh, species that went extinct and the Lord going to bring back. Mm. Even with the animals, Taz, they probably we're gonna see Tasmanian tigers again. Saber two, saber two, saber two, saber two. all that woolly yeah. mammoths. That's gonna be some dope ass shit, though. Cause you know the most high is uh, ain't, ain't gonna let some states think like that. No, no, nothing go extinct. Cause the most high is merciful. No, nothing go extinct. No, nothing go extinct. Right. There's no new thing. For real. And man, the earlier world, man, like when we first started built, mate, the first six thousand years. Imagine what them trees and whatever was growing for six thousand, five, four thousand years. And know? just like the scripture said too, uh, the the trees are going to rejoice in the kingdom. Yeah. Like I said, cause just think how many trees though they didn't put that to extinction. Mm -hmm. Chopping so many down. Just chopping. Chopping shit down. I mean, the Most High gave us different woods and different trees to use to build. That's actually what they was made for. The Most High. But you know, you know how you know how these devils do it. They just the devil can't have. I mean. It's, it's okay to build some stuff, but they take the shit too far. Just look at downtown right here. You take you take the shit too goddamn far. You don't turn the world into a fucking horror movie with this shit out here. Yeah, wasteland. Okay. And I will make the place of my feet glorious. The sun's also. Oh, hold on, sorry. I was about to say something. Right, you going to them trees though? Cause you know the most I did make different trees. Cause you know certain trees. And you know the sap that comes out of each tree has a different purpose. You know that? Yeah. I was studying some uh sap syrup. Yeah, syrup. all that syrup. Yeah, some tree sap can actually be made into syrup. Yeah. 
there's a, there's, there's a ton of shit that you're supposed to eat. Yeah, I, which they, that's the kind they use for certain them fake ass honeys that they be selling in some stores. It's actually, uh, it's actually a, a cheap uh, uh, syrup that they make, you know, good yeah. uh, honey flavor to it. Yep. From the devil. Remember the fucking devil? Man. Some of it makes that real sticky shit too. You, they used on um, boats to seal the boats up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a good yeah. one. I'm off I was reading uh I was reading in plenty was it plenty I can't say that shit. Some trees is just literally supposed to be here just so they can Yeah, that's why cause you oxygen. got cause you got tree huggers environmentalists saying we shouldn't cut no trees now. Nah that trees is they're they there for wood. This shit got a purpose. Why do you think yeah yeah, certain wood you can't burn. Like like cedar. Cedar is like something that's good for cooking with. Ain't that amazing smell, man? Yeah, oh. cedar. And the some... flavor it causes. Yeah. That, that's the, none of this is, That's all by design. The Most High gave us all these different woods, and each tree gives you a different type of wood. Like, you just can't make a guitar out of any kind of wood. You trying to tell me that ain't by design. That, it has to be by design. design yeah. Oh, oh, Evolution. <laughs> it's all by design. It's all just... Like I said, even when each tree gives out its own different type of sap that can be used for different things. Some of them guitar woods they find in the waters that's been sitting in the waters for so far. Oh yeah, that, that's that treated yeah, water. Somehow it ages a certain way in the water. Yep. Yeah, because certain woods, woods are, they say it might have a better tone like uh, ash has, or might be softer, easier to work with. Maple is hard as shit. The hardest wood is maple. You know? Well, one of them, go ahead. Around the 28, 19. Like, when thou shalt see the sea in long time, it make more instant to take it, thou shalt not destroy the trees thereof by force and accident. Thou mayest eat of them, and thou shalt not cut them in the trees. Thou shalt not cut them down, see the seals of man's life. To avoid them, and the seeds only the trees which thou knowest. That they do not treat the meat, thou shalt destroy it and cut them down. And thou shalt put bullocks against the city that make it more risky until it be severe. Esau will bring in a whole motherfucking gang of uh, uh, lumberjackers, man. <laughs> oh, I got a one for you. Like, uh, yeah, Esau will come with the lumberjacks. Hey, you know the Ikea tree? Ikea? How do you say Ikea? Ikea? Some people say that they're burning. I don't know. They got to do more research on it. I've never heard the elders talk about it. But, you, but they say some people think that the burning bush in the Bible might have been in the key of tree. Or, uh, but the promised land is not as land of milk and honey, right? But I'm going to hit y'all with something. Like the Israelites, you know what they would do? They, they would purposely put beehives in a key of tree because the, the bees... That, that tree in its pollen, you know, the breeze, you know how the bees go out to get the pollen. Because that, that, the flowers on that tree made better tasting honey. Check that out. They, they would purposely put it in there. And where do we get all that knowledge from? You know? The bees do it. They already do it on their own anyway. They produce their own specific honey. Yes. You know? That's an intelligence. That's how you the most high had to teach all that to Adam and crazy. our forefathers and all that. That's crazy. I don't think man just figured everything out by itself. The most high showed him shit. Like had had to have showed him. Had to. Had to have showed him writing. Had to, the writing just appeared out of nowhere. Had to show them agriculture. That shit just appeared out of nowhere. Yeah. Most I put it in him. He could probably yeah. talk to the animals. Yeah. Yeah. That's where they got Dr. Doolittle from. Yeah, Dr. Doolittle. Uh, Solomon, the yeah. scriptures That's straight right. up say yeah. he could talk to animals. That's right. That's right. So I'm pretty sure he wasn't yeah. the first one. Yeah, yeah. If he could do it, I'm sure someone else could do it. You already know they got intelligence, because remember the donkey that kept getting hit by it. Oh, shit. You know? That's, that's yeah. Came out speaking. Some bugged out shit. He keeps smoking. Why do keep hitting me? I ain't getting nothing to simple ass nigga. <laughs> shit. But it's pretty much what he was saying. I ain't getting nothing to you. Yep. I ain't getting nothing to you. 
And that's how motherfuckers are. It's cruel to the animals, man. They really are. The angel, but the, 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 but the donkey kept seeing the angel, man. I'm not going down oh, there. Oh, yeah. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I seen cats and dogs act strange, man, but you didn't know what the hell, what are you doing? What are you, why are you acting like that? Yeah, because they see But you don't see it. They, they see it. We don't see it. Yeah. They can tell you, so most of the time. Man, I bet they seen all kind of amazing shit, man. They probably do. You know, I'm seeing my cats and listen. They got nothing to do with it. They got nothing to do with it. They got nothing to do with it. They got nothing They all got shorter lives than us, too. Yeah, we gonna see all kind of shit, man. I saw that cat, that cat was looking up. Damn, was an angel behind me? We gonna see all, man, we gonna, oh, man, it's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be crazy, man. All kind of past stuff we gonna be able to pull up. <laughs> oh, this is beautiful, man. Okay, where was I at? Verse 14, the sons also of them that afflict thee shall come oh. bending unto thee, and all they that despise thee, all they so that despise thee. All of them that despise us? That's a whole lot. It says, and all they that despise thee shall what? bow themselves down and at the souls of thy feet. And really that's talking about the other nations. That's talking about East starting with Esau first. He despises the most. Why you think he had got these abortion clinics on all the all over the place? Well they try and get rid of them now. What they call it's a name called it's a broken term for that. What, they call it? what is it? Yeah, yeah, not playing parents, but uh, how they, this is uh, Esau term for it, like uh, Infanticide? Uh, uh, genocide? Infanticide? Genocide? Euthanasia? I don't know. Right. <laughs> they definitely, That's his goal is, actually. To try to try to oh, going back to your boy Dick, Dick Gregory. Oh, man, I was watching some Dick Gregory. Dick. It's the last thing you want to do is start watching his videos. Uh, you mean, now I, I watch one movie, I watch twenty of them. <laughs> <laughs> and he was like, he's like, how come on these drive-bys ain't nobody ever getting shot in the body? It's always headshot. <laughs> what? That's what he was going on some shit. But he said, you know how it, they say, you know, Esau really out here killing people, and they know so. Oh, it was a drive-by. It was this and that. Cause come on, where's all these ultra-violent people they talk about? I mean, I know Jake is a savage. But he's yeah. not that savage. <laughs> Can you tell me them motherfuckers get caught by police officers? There's cameras every goddamn way. Oh, yeah. They can check the cells and shit. We're not keeping Avenue. Every so long you see them cameras. But he's just saying, you know, a lot of these murders and stuff that they say is murders and gang violence is actually just a white man going out and just killing people. Going and having his fun. It's like I heard them stories about in Chicago that they would just leave guns in the middle of the street in the neighborhood. Big ass car with Doing shit on purpose. Yeah. This is his kingdom. He allowed to do that. But if them curses are coming so on Esau slowly, man. Oh, they are. Esau's starting to get caught up in some shit, too. He is, too. <laughs> For real, like that one Edomite that owned that pharmaceutical company. Remember who boosted it? Oh, about the AIDS yeah, medicine? Yeah, he locked up now. Oh, he, they, yeah, they are a lot of them getting locked up. Yeah. That curses. devil, years ago, that they got that devil Bernie Madoff. Yeah. They got his oh, ass. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They've been getting them a little, I don't know, maybe. It's hittable. Yeah. Something to play with. But they fucking with uh, man, you know these politicians. They always threatening to lock each other up. But man, fuck these faggots. Right, right. Like Hillary Clinton, everybody, half the country wants to lock her up. <laughs> yeah, just think she untouchable. Yeah, she really does think she untouchable. She really do. I actually think they might get her one day. I don't oh, know. Man, be well, we might have to. These motherfuckers out here is crazy now. We gonna get her. They with these people that anti-gun shit. They about to lose their goddamn minds. Mm -hmm. Oh, with all, I'm talking about. Uh, you know, all, all this anti-gun shit going on. Yeah, yeah. All these good old boys, man, they fit. That shit is beautiful. They fit the snap. They need to hurry up and escalate that gun I know, shit. man. I'm just waiting for that day we wake up, man. It's going to be an explosion. Both bro. sides are full of shit right now. <laughs> oh, man. Come on, push it, man. Turn them up. Turn up the heat, man. I yeah. want to see these motherfucking great Americans go crazy, man. Whew. I want to see these motherfucking great Americans flip the fuck out. Limitation 4 and 21. Rejoice and be glad, O daughter of Edom. O daughter of Edom, which is a so-called white man. Go ahead. That dwellest in the land of Uz, the cup also shall pass through unto thee. When that's talking about that cup of slavery, that cup of torment, you know? Curses. Yeah, curses. Thou shalt be drunken and shall make thyself naked. Thou yeah, because 
Man, Esau ain't did nothing but fucking torture fucking Israel. Still Straight Jesus. fucking torture. I mean, beyond torture. <laughs> it's some sick shit they doing to us, man. Sick shit. Sick shit. The psychological fucking damage is worse than the physical damage. I was reading how uh, Esau dumped a whole bunch of infected fleas in North Korea. Man. North Korea. Fucking fleas. Fleas. Infected fleas. Infected fleas.